Hello, my name is Reverend Ashley Love, and I have the great joy of being the pastor here at First Presbyterian Church of Stockton. And I am making this video to let you know all about something really exciting that is happening in the life of our church. And that is that our beautiful building here on the corner of El Dorado and Vine in the Magnolia area, district of Stockton, is turning a hundred years old. Old. If you can believe it, it was uh, March 25th, 1923, when this campus uh, was dedicated and uh, began its time as the home of our congregation. And so we are so excited to celebrate a hundred years of God moving in amazing ways through this building and um, blessing this community, this city, all of us who have been a part of the communities who have worshiped and fellowshiped and served and prayed and uh, experienced life here within this campus. And so we are going to celebrate with two big events and I wanna make sure and invite you to both of them. The first is going to be on the 25th, our actual birthday for the building. And that is going to be a community festival. It's on Saturday, March 25th from 11 to three. We are going to be having uh, jumpers for kids and different art activities. We're going to have musical performances from local community groups, as well as high school jazz bands, high school musical. Uh, there's going to be a drum circle with our dear uh, friend and former accompanist here, Ethan Albala's uh, group. Um, we are going to have um, church tours. The building will be open and there will be church members stationed at various places explaining the history of the building. Um, we're going to have a free yoga class at 11 a.m. If you would like to be a part of that yoga class, you'll just bring your mat if you have one. If not, that's okay too. We are asking for reservations, not reservations, RSVPs for that. If you could call our office just to have a sense of how many people are coming to that. One of our basketball groups um, will be here on campus as well. We will have a lot of our community partners tabling. Um, so if you are interested in getting to know some of the people, the groups, the organizations that have used this building over the years, we will have those folks available um, tabling there in our parking lot. Uh, and also we will have food trucks. So it is going to be such a fun event. Um, if you would like to help with volunteering, let us know, contact the office. Otherwise, if you'd like to just come and have fun, uh, it's gonna be such a joyful time to celebrate and to share this day with our larger community. And then on Sunday, we are going to have a worship service specifically dedicated to giving thanks to worshiping God for these 100 years of life on this campus. And so that is going to be at 4 p.m. in the afternoon. We will still have our 11 o'clock service in the morning. This will be an additional service and very different. Um, the service at four is going to have videos and appearances from former pastors and members. Um, we're going to have a special organ piece from our very own organist, June Lee, who will just blow us away. I'm so excited to hear the organ really stretch her legs because um, our organ is also turning 100 years old. And uh, we will have certainly the choir. Um, we'll have lots of sharing memories, looking at pictures, uh, just considering and giving thanks and also praying for the future of life on this campus moving forward as we move into the second hundred years of uh, life here. And so then after following that worship service, we are going to have a large catered dinner that we want to continue the party and enjoy each other and get to spend time and share memories and um, celebrate together. And so uh, we do ask that you would RSVP by contacting the office if you are going to be staying for the dinner, just so we know how much, um, how many people are going to be there um, and can prepare adequately for food. But that is going to be a really, really fun time as well. So this whole weekend is just going to be a joyous celebration. We already have friends that we're so excited about who are coming from out of state, out of 
town, everywhere to come and celebrate with us. And it, we certainly invite you to come and join us as well. Uh, the worship service on Sunday will be broadcast online live, so you'll be able to watch it online. But if you're able to come here in person and just uh, be within these walls, give thanks for this building with us. We are so, so inviting you to come and be a part, whether it's you haven't been here in years and years or whether you worship here with us every Sunday, you are so welcome. And uh, we look forward to seeing you on that weekend, March 25th for the community event that Saturday, and then March 26th at 4 p.m. for our special worship service. Can't wait to see you there.